Hi everyone, I'm here with my sister Talita. She is 17, turning 18 in a week at the time that we're filming this. And today we're going to be doing a sister tag because why not? We've been wanting to do it for a long time, since May, I think. April. April. <laughs> so yeah, this is the sister tag. So thank you to Marissa uh, for doing the questions for us. So I will go ahead and read the first question. Do you know what your sister's favorite musical artist is? And if so, explain why they take a liking to them. Your favorite artist <laughs> is 21 Pilots. And you like them because... <laughs> I feel like they get your emo feelings. <laughs> yeah, that's, yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's, that's right. That sounds um, really dark. So your favorite artist um, is Michael Jackson. And you like him because he's good looking. Um, he's really good at singing. He's a good dancer. He's a good actor. Basically, everything he does is good. Perfect. Yeah, he's perfect. <laughs> so that's why. All right, number two. Close your eyes and on the number three, point to the person who is the better driver. Elaborate after eyes are opened. One, two, three. three. <laughs> I guess I, I don't even have my license and well, I'm scared to go on the street. I, yeah, I think that's. We, we don't really know yet, because you haven't driven on the main road, at least not that I've seen. I think you did once. And that was a bad experience. Um, so you're still learning to drive, but we can reassess. Um, <laughs> next year. Next, next year. year. <laughs> I'm not I'm an okay driver. I, you're I, a really good driver. Oh, thank you. Except when you change lights. But actually, you fixed that. Yeah, I know. I've been working. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Number three. Close your eyes and on the number three, point to who you believe is the more emotional one. Explain. Okay, wait, I need to think, I need about, to think about that too. Okay, okay. One, two, three. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you explain. Well, I don't know. I was deciding, like, it was hard to decide because you don't cry in front of me. Yeah. But me, because past couple of weeks. <laughs> I've been a little bit of a mess. <laughs> yeah, um, yeah, that was my reasoning. I think, I think you have more, like, crises. Like, I do. You had... Because I keep it all in, and yeah. then I explode. Go on your phone and find your favorite photo of your sister. Explain why you chose it. This That's a good <laughs> one. <laughs> this is gonna be really embarrassing. Okay, no. I'm in this picture, but this is my favorite picture of you. <laughs> I'm dead. I. That's a good one. That, I yeah. like that one. I just want everyone to see it. Oh, oh no! Because it's just like so inspirational. <laughs> I was really cringy then. No, you were like famous. Yeah, I would. Put... 18 likes. <laughs> wow. I wore my justice clothes and I really thought I was making a statement. <laughs> okay, that was a good one. Um. Okay. Where. Yeah, okay. Where do you think your sibling wants to live when they're older? You can go first. Okay. I think you want to live in Canada. Calvary. You got it. You got it. Well, do I have to explain? <laughs> like, that's home. Yeah. Um. I feel like I make it unclear. <laughs> yeah, I was either gonna say Israel <laughs> or Calgary. Because what? I feel like you want to get your medical school stuff over with and then you want to go to Canada because I don't know a lot of reasons residency. I don't know. There's like <laughs> two medical schools in Canada. I mean in <laughs> what in Calgary, right? There's only two. I Read it on the website you sent me Anyway, um I'm wrong. What is it? You think there's two medical schools in all of Canada? No! Calgary! Oh. Okay, where do you want to live? I don't know. <laughs> no, I actually always say I don't know. Because cause I want to go to Calgary, but then it depends on a lot of things. But I don't really like it here. And I never wanted to live in Israel. I don't know where you got that from. I want to go. Yeah, okay. That's probably where I got it from. But not stay there. Okay. <laughs> okay. Next question. 
In your opinion, what do you think is the perfect profession for your sister? Does this align with your sister's professional goals? Mm. <laughs> I know what I want. Um, oh, that's hard. Okay, I'll answer. I think she should be... Oh, what's the name for that? Oh, what was the question? I think the perfect career... You know, I have two. One of them should be an impersonator. <laughs> oh, yeah! Because she is good at impersonating everyone. Thank you. Like Palpatine? <laughs> no. 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 <laughs> and Anakin? <laughs> I don't like sand. sand. It's coarse, rough, rough and irritating. irritating. And it gets <laughs> everywhere. <laughs> but it's the exact same. You'd have to watch it. Okay. Okay. Second job. Um. Like an animator, but I feel like you would hate that after a couple of weeks. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> and does that match with your goals? Yeah, my profession. No. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. She's studying stocks, money. Yeah. Business. Business. That's pretty good. Um, I was gonna say for you, um, I feel like you'd really enjoy owning your own daycare because... You'd be rich if it was successful, <laughs> and you really like children. Like, you just, like, I feel like you would make it like a very good home. And you'd be like, oh, the children. <laughs> Does it align with your professional goals? But, uh, um, kind of. I mean, I feel like you'd be a really good doctor. I feel like you're just in the middle of like figuring out if that's Crisis. what you want. Yeah. Because your professional goals are medical field. Right? Yes. Yeah, so I don't, I think that, that would work. It's pretty close. For kids, yeah, a pediatrician? Yeah. Not the foot doctor. <laughs> Podiatrist or the pedestrian. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, if you could both, wait, yeah. If you could both only eat, wait. If you both could only eat from one restaurant for the rest of your lives, what would it be? You both have to agree on one restaurant together. Oh. <laughs> that's a that's okay. good. Okay. <sighs> okay, Chick-fil-A. But they don't have enough dessert. They don't. They have more than other restaurants. What do they have? They have the brownie, they have the cookie, they have the milkshakes. Where's the ice cream? Oh, ice cream. The ice cream, they have the ice cream. But is it actually ice cream? Yeah, it's really good ice cream. It's soft serve ice cream. Do you have You like, can't even have a burger. Yeah, but isn't there one that has both? Yeah, like McDonald's. Okay, but then that- That'd be good. <laughs> but I feel like- I kind of want McDonald's. Oh, I want to go to McDonald's. We can go. Oh, I'm trying to fight my cravings. Okay, Burger King sucks. Yeah. Jack in the Box is poisonous. Um, I was thinking Dairy Queen, not because of the ice cream. Oh, yeah, that's <laughs> but because they have other food. What yeah. about Canes? Canes is good, but they only, they, they only really have don't have dessert. Okay. They only have chicken. Like, they don't even have sides but like, why why aren't we do. why aren't we picking like an actual restaurant that has like oh okay stuff? okay um like oh, what but then we'll go into debt mm. 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 see but chick-fil-a has breakfast i know they, they have a really good variety they have sausage okay for breakfast okay oh and their hash browns are really good yeah okay chick-fil-a Chick -fil what is the one thing you believe your sister could easily beat you at, even if you tried your hardest? I have two. Am I allowed to say two answers? Yeah, but then let me come up with two answers. Okay, that's fair. Okay, I have two. A fashion show? Because 
I cannot dress. And like, I mean, I, I think I can, but like every time I come out of my room, you're like, you're wearing that. <laughs> and I feel like you just know like the colors that go together. And for me, it's just always these black shorts and my Pacific Nation <laughs> shirt. So I feel like even if I try my hardest, like I actually really try to make a good outfit. Like I feel like it just wouldn't. Um, oh, what was it? Oh, the next one would be a dance off because like I actually dance. like I know you hate improvising but like I really hate imp like what do I do we saw when you danced in the rain <laughs> oh yeah when I danced in the rain you would beat me in chess oh thank you <laughs> mine are not very creative but you beat me in chess and If we're, <laughs> if we're trying to convince our parents of something, like, I'm really bad at it. She's like perfect with words. <laughs> that's a good one. Yeah, that's a good one. Thank you. <laughs> These are good questions. They are, actually. If your sister was a singer slash songwriter, what kind of music do you think they'd make? I think you would write sorry olivia rodrigo lyrics but to like a very upbeat like like disco 70s like and like party music but then it's very like i don't need him like just very like <laughs> i love everything like that kind of music that made no sense Olivia Rodrigo? Yeah, she, the, all her songs are like, I don't need him. Is that the vibe I give off? Well, yes it Yeah. Is. <laughs> okay. Well, you've made music before. But you, I don't know if you've written. It might be a secret. <laughs> I don't know. Okay. Um... This is like, this sounds like I'm not putting any thought into it, but I feel like it would be like 21 Pilots. Because the stuff that you've made that I've heard gives off the same okay. thing. Why do you have Tostito chips in here? I was hungry. <laughs> okay. Um, the lyrics... I feel like... The lyrics would be... Wait, actually no. It would no 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 wait. It would be a mix of of um the Beatles. Like their instrumentals. Okay. That's actually And I feel like the lyrics would be more twenty one pilots. That's that's good. That's good. If your sister was an instrument, what instrument would she be? Elaborate. Uh, I know. Oh. Well, I know what you're You'd be a harp, because it's like the Christian instrument, and it's like very like soft spoken, but like you can play really good songs on the harp. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> um. Okay, so now I need to come with something nice. You can say trumpet. It's fine. I was gonna say trombone, <laughs> but I don't know why, because you're not. Well. <laughs> Um, I would say saxophone because sometimes Ooh. when you laugh, it's like a really high pitch. If your sister was stuck on a deserted island, what three items do you think she would bring and why? Okay, I got it. And they all start with B. I knew it. I knew you were going to say that. Benny, Bible, <laughs> and Boombox. <laughs> Because that is so random. Okay, well, go on. Because you really like stuffed animals. <laughs> okay. Um, just... Bible, because I just feel like you would read it. Like the aesthetic of the deserted island, just like <laughs> Romans open, just like wow. Um, and then the boom box, because you can listen to music. Do you need to plug that in? 
Uh, no, because people, when boys come outside the house, they have it on their That's shoulder. True. Um, when boys come out of their house. <laughs> like, it happens to <laughs> us. Um, yeah. Okay. I think you'd bring the Bible, the piano, and then I was trying to think of the third one. I was going to say a Chick-fil-A gift card, but you said you don't want to eat. And there's no Chick-fil-A there. It's deserted. Who works there? Okay. Um, and... Oh, all your self-help books. <laughs> That's actually a good one. Yeah, you probably. <laughs> what do you think your sister's future apartment slash house will look like? I feel like it'll be black. Really? You're definitely gonna... <laughs> You're definitely gonna have ginormous windows everywhere. Okay. And... Yeah. Okay. Well, I actually want an all-white house, so... Like, I want nice, like, shiny, minimalist, like, nice, <laughs> nice house. Um, not that other houses aren't nice. Uh, <laughs> for you, I think you would have a lot of, like, neutral baby colors. So, like, a light pink for some of the rooms. Maybe, like, a light yellow and a Your light... perception of me is so weird. Like, Easter. Are you being serious? I'm serious? <laughs> no, you're not. In yes, my I actual am. house, what colors would I make it? Okay, brown? <laughs> white? Yeah, yeah. you go, like, an off-white, like a gray, right? Gray? Off-white! We haven't even talked about the furniture yet. I feel like you'd have a lot of effort in your kitchen. I feel like you'd have a lot of wooden, like, cute things. And maybe a lot of uh, Bible verses from Ross and Hobby Lobby on the walls. Like, um, uh, um, live, laugh, love. That's a Bible verse. <laughs> no, no, no. Like, um, like, family first. Or, <laughs> or like, um, um. Uh, uh, what are some? Like, this is making me seem <laughs> like, like so weird. Wooden spoons in the kitchen. That's my conclusion. Okay. I think we should move on. Okay. How has your relationship with your sister grown over the past year or so? Let's do past 10 years. That's a little more spicy. Okay. Should I go? Hello? Uh huh. Are you okay? Yeah. Did you get possessed? No, I just remembered, like, the things we did to each other. When we were okay, like... so ten years ago, so I was seven. And... What? And I was eleven. I think... I don't really remember anything from the last year of Calgary. Okay. Like, we were just there. And then... <laughs> I guess... When you became a teenager, things got weird because I did not like you and you really didn't like me. No. And I was really upset about it, so we scratched each other. <laughs> we fought each other a lot. Then, <laughs> when I became like 13, 12, okay. 12 we, we got a little better. But we'd have petty arguments. Yeah. But then we weren't allowed to hit each other anymore. <laughs> <laughs> I think freshman year, we just got normal. Your freshman year. My freshman year. And now we are very normal. Yeah, now I think it's normal. Um. Yeah, we literally had, when I said, you're getting on my nerves at the table, we thought it was so funny. When did you say that? It was the day you didn't pick me up from school, and you thought I was mad that you didn't pick me up. And then at the <laughs> table, I was like, you're oh, getting yeah. on my nerves. <laughs> and then that was so funny. I pushed you a lot. We, I, I did. I, <laughs> no, I, I hit your arms a lot, and then that's when you attacked me. <laughs> um, oh, we kicked each other a lot. <laughs> we um, had a pillow fight once, and I broke the lamp. Do you remember that?
She threw a glass cup at me. That was an accident. Okay, but not the first time. <laughs> we should get there. We should. It will be like the the. Sound like part two. <laughs> <laughs> no, because I literally thought that, but I was like, do it again. <laughs> Messages. I need to like look at our old text messages. Oh no, I'll like, leave them. No, I'll look at them. Is that your music? Can't you wear headphones? <laughs> and then you said, hey. And then I, I ignored you, but all of those messages. <laughs> They're snoring and I'm going to die. <laughs> I want chocolate and milk. They raking a horn any? <laughs> a hot many. Horn many? I feel like I'm gonna die. <laughs> I'm, like I'm yelling inside of my head. I'm listening <laughs> to Nick Jonas. What is one thing about having your sister that makes you happy? I, I... go. No, <laughs> just, just go. I think oh, this is gonna be so cheesy. Okay, it's just like you know. Sometimes in life, you want a best friend, but then they're not. <laughs> They're like, they are your best friend, but then it's never that, you never get that sense of like full security, but I feel like I have that with you. Aww. Like I, you're my diary. I yeah, tell, I tell much. her everything. And the fact that you're older than me helps because you like give me advice. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I see. Um. I actually feel the same way, <laughs> but like the opposite. When you can't come up with an answer. No, like, not the opposite, the first part, the opposite, the second part. Like, I feel like because I've done everything already, I really enjoy like making Living the through. plan and I'm like, this is what's gonna happen. Like, I like helping you with your math homework because I like math and I feel like like when you were going through high school, I was like, I did already. And then you're like, college, I was like, I did that already. Like you get to watch? Yeah. And like you don't, you haven't gotten a job yet, but I feel like when you get a job, like it's gonna be the same thing. And I'm gonna be like, ah, ah. <laughs> And then stocks, I like helping you with stocks. I like teaching you. When you help me with stocks? Like talking to you about them. Oh, I love that so much. <laughs> um, <clears throat> I like helping you with things. Teaching you piano. <laughs> um, but yeah, I agree. I think um, it would be very lonely. Like, I feel like very like, like when I get in trouble, like I would just <laughs> want to die. Like, yeah. What do I do? Cause then it's like I don't want to bother my friends if I have to tell them anything. But like I don't care if you're annoyed with me. Yeah, I really don't. Like it's very like I don't care. Yeah, like it doesn't really. That is nice. I wonder what the last question is gonna be. Give one reason as to why you believe your sister is an amazing person. Don't be afraid to get mushy gushy. Just or is it mushy gushy? Mitsubishi. What's the question? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I feel like you have your head on straight. And I feel like you are very wise so i feel like that is setting you up for a very good future <laughs> and i feel like you have oh oh another reason is i think you're very you have this very good self-confidence in like who you are like you know like you don't rely on anyone too much you you just like know who you are pretty much and so i feel like lots of people don't so <laughs> that's probably my reason. Okay, because I was going to say the same thing. The first part I was going to say, I feel like you know what you're doing. Like you have it figured out. And, oh. Um, I think you're a really good listener. You're like oh. the best listener. Really? And 
a good person at giving advice. That was more than one. Um, Thank I don't you. know how to answer that. That's a good uh, answer. Mm -hmm. Thank you. So that was our sister tag. Thank you for watching. Uh, do you have any final words? No. Okay. <laughs> Thanks for watching and bye.